Hey guys, welcome to another Server Miner plugin tutorial. I'm your host, LTGym007, and today we're looking at the Firework Maker plugin. Now, this is a really fantastic plugin which allows you to create fireworks really easily in a GUI, customize them fully, and even put a cost to them. So, if we do forward slash Firework Maker, it will open up the GUI, or FWM for short, and initially we can choose the amount of effects that the firework has. So for this tutorial, we're gonna start with one and then make a couple with a few more effects. Now, while we're in here, we can choose the type, the color, the fade, uh, whether it has a trail or not, and whether it flickers or not in here. So a couple of them are just toggles, so you put it on or off, and you can change the different color. There is a long list of different colors as well, uh, which is really awesome. And if we look at type, there is ball, ball large, burst, creeper, and star. So let's go ahead and click Creeper, go into the colors. As you see, there's a lot. Let's choose lime green and dark blue. Then if we go into power, we can change the duration of the flight, which means how high it goes. Obviously one is low, two is medium, and three is really high. Let's go ahead and set it to night. And if we fire off the firework, it will go up, it will go green and then blue and fade out. So that is a simple demonstration. So that was the Creeper effect. Let's go ahead and create a brand new one by doing forward slash FWM and maybe selecting two effects this time. So the way we do this is the same way you select whether you want the ball, you want the colors, whether you want flicker, uh, the secondary color and the trail. And once you've done that, you click next effect and you select it all again, choosing different ones this time. And then when we uh, go on to the next stage, we can choose the flight duration and then it will give us our two effect firework. Select, let's select the power and there we go. So if we shoot it up, we will see that there are the two effects. They start out white and then go to purple and cyan. And that is how it looks like. It looks fantastic. And you can make so many different cool fireworks with this. And it's very easy to do as well, rather than going into a config file and messing around with loads of values, etc. So finally, what I want to do is create um, a really big firework with three effects. Uh, let's go ahead and do this. So I'm going to really quickly go through it, select things at random, uh, just to give you an idea of the sort of things you can make. But if you download this plugin yourself, uh, you can have a play with it and mess around and see what you can do with it. So um, there we go. We need to select one more and then we will have our epic firework. Let's select Creeper for the last one and trail on, select the power, let's go to one, and let's have a look at this. And kaboom, there we go. So it's a mishmash of different fireworks. It looks really cool. And if we select those together, uh, it'll just look pretty crazy and colorful, which looks awesome. So that is pretty much everything in game. So here we are in the server minor control panel. And if we go into the firework maker folder, we will see there's a single config.yml. So let's go ahead and open that up. And in here, there isn't too much but we will see that the prices for everything can be changed. So up at the top, let's go ahead and set pricing to true. And that will mean uh, players will get billed for every effect and color they choose. So um, there are a couple of different permissions. So the, the permission to actually get in the GUI and make it and the bypass permission, which means me as an admin or op uh, will not get charged for making fireworks. And then it's pretty straightforward. You have all of the different effects and types and all that good stuff, different prices. So by default, they're in hundreds, but you could change it to 10, you could change it to a million, uh, whatever you want, but that is how you do it. It's very straightforward. And it's a fantastic little plugin that you can add to your server, uh, maybe give to donators, admins, to make, to make sure they can create uh, the coolest fireworks. If you want to download it, the link will be in the description as always. If you need a server to host it on, check out serverminer.com for the cheapest and best hosting around. So that's it for me for this week. Subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.